2.7c, multiply and divide mixed numbers. To do math with mixed numbers, it is easiest to convert to a fraction. You just have to make sure that when you have your answer, you convert it back. This is the same as we did in adding and subtracting mixed numbers. Let's look at example one. In example one, we have two mixed numbers multiplied together. So we first must change them both into fractions. We do this by multiplying and then adding in a clockwise fashion. Five times two is ten, plus four is fourteen fifths. 7 times 3 is 21, plus 4 is 25 sevenths. Remember, we must then reduce before multiplying. 7 goes into 7 once, goes into 14 twice, 5 goes into 5 once, and goes into 25 five times. 2 times 5 is 10 over 1, but remember we don't write numbers over 1 because that's not simplified, so the answer is just 10. As you can see, there's nothing to convert back as the number is just 10. Let's look at example two. In example two, we're dividing mixed numbers, but we first must change them both to fractions, just as before. So we do multiplying and adding in a clockwise fashion. Three times five is 15, plus one is 16 thirds. It is still division, and then we do six times two is twelve, plus one is thirteen sixths. We can now turn this into a multiplication problem by having sixteen thirds times the reciprocal six thirteenths. Remember we reduce before multiplying, three goes into three once and into six twice. This gives us thirty two thirteenths. Now we must convert this back by doing long division. Thirteen goes into thirty-two two times, which gives us twenty-six with a remainder of six. This means our fraction is two and six thirteenths. Remember when multiplying or dividing with mixed numbers, we must first convert the mixed number to a fraction, but then convert our answers back. 